Uh, welcome to DevOps Party Games, because if we don't laugh at DevOps, we would probably cry. And Maddie, this isn't just any DevOps Party Games. This is a very special Seagull edition of DevOps Party Games. And I am uh, your host, Maddie Stratton, at Matt Stratton on Twitter. And joining me is a special guest host, which is... That's right. My name is Paul. Maddie, I got to say, your hair looks extra luscious today. Did you use extra Pantene this morning? I, I do see the secret is I don't wash it, is what I've been told, oh. is, is how that works. So I like when sloth combines with fashion. So the 90s were good to me. We'll just put it that way. So I, I tried that method and Sasha started telling me that I needed to wash my hair. So I gave up on that method. <laughs> yeah. Well, you have to eventually wash it. Also, <laughs> both of our pictures on the screen right now are at <laughs> very different looks than, uh, than, than we currently are. So, you know, there's, there's that. Um, but yeah, so we've been, uh, if this is you, uh, if, if you've tuned in to DevOps party games in the past, welcome back. If you're uh, joining us for the first time, maybe uh, having participated in Seagull today and then also tomorrow, you haven't participated tomorrow, but you will. Uh, we're going to explain a little bit of how the uh, show works. Um, what did, what did this, do what happened to this document? Wow. Okay, I sorry. We have a script, but it got all weird. Anyway, so whatever. Who gives a crap? We're just going to talk and we're just going to go. Here's what's going to happen. We got a couple different uh, games we're going to play. You may have seen them before if you're familiar with Jackbox. If you're not, that's okay. You just need to watch and play along. And we have a great group of uh, contestants who are going to be playing. All of our content is customized using uh, DevOps or tech or cloud or dev type uh, or ops, if you will, uh, type prompts. And what we're going to do here is just try to um, uh, be entertaining. And this is really throwing me that I don't know what happened to my Google Doc that was uh, that had all my script in it. And so that's okay. That's okay. Hey, Seagull organizer, aren't you glad you asked me to do this? I'm so good at it. Such uh, a let's, professional. Let's just get right into it and uh, meet our our players. Well, hold on, hold on, Matty. Oh, 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 I, oh, I need oh, to oh. I need to say a few things. Oh, okay, and yeah, because there's is, a bunch of things. They're just not in the yeah, document I don't know. anymore. I don't know what happened. I, I actually took a copy of it, so I'm glad I did. Yeah. Well, uh, maybe I hit Control X. I think you did. C? It says last last edit was made 24 minutes ago by Paul. Uh oh, yeah, that'll that'll be my bad then. Yep. Yeah, you just deleted everything. Well. Wow. Anyways, <laughs> before we get here, started, we go. Yes, I, I found do them. request yeah. that all players and chat participants. Put your bikes away before we get started, please. And I need you all to abide by our code of conduct, which you can find at devopspartygames.com. Please remember that, yes, we do have that code of conduct. And tonight, due to some very delicate ears, this game is going to be rated PG-13. And this means we only get one F-bomb. So let's make it count, folks. The... Um... And by the way, I did now find myself back in uh, all the things you've deleted, thanks to version history. So during each of the games that we're playing, uh, you, the audience, will uh, find an icon, much like a present or a package, uh, on your Twitch video. This is how you can join the audience, which is how you participate by voting for your favorite answers. Um, well, the other ways you can do that. This does influence the results of the game. So we really encourage you to do that. I already see that four people have already joined the audience. So go five. Awesome. 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 Fantastic. And uh, if you are tweeting about the show and we hope you do, uh, please use the hashtag uh, DevOps party games, but uh, let's go ahead and now get into it and introduce our contestants. Our first player is uh, Ben. Ben, thank you for coming to DevOps Party Games. And uh, what's your favorite thing about Seagull? Uh, I think my favorite thing is that I got to be introduced first so that other people don't steal my favorite thing and then I sound like I'm repeating them. This is this is uh, the pro, pro move there, pro move. Um, our next up, we have Deb. Deb, uh, tell us a little bit about your favorite thing about Seagull. Uh. It sounds really hokey, but I love the people. Everyone here is so nice. Um, I'll, I'll, I'll get more snarky later on. <laughs> awesome. And then, Bri, uh, what uh, what would be your uh, favorite thing about, about Seagull? 
Uh, this year, it was actually one of the talks, the stories we don't tell by Don Collette. And one of the things that I always hate about Seagull is that Deb and I always have our presentations at the same time and I never get to see it first. Uh, that, that seems, uh, after, after a certain point in time, do you certain, maybe feel like maybe, maybe there's uh, some intentionality to that? You know, oh, I'm positive. Of taking it, it personal? <laughs> it's totally, totally intentional. <laughs> And uh, we have a return player, uh, someone who has uh, been on DevOps Party Games in the past. Um, that would be Katie. Katie, what's what's been your favorite thing about Seagull? Being able to attend a conference where the conference doesn't steal my chips. Oh, wait, wrong Seagull. <laughs> and Rachel. Rachel, we already warned Rachel that she had to keep her answer to maybe about one sentence. But yes, Rachel, what is your favorite thing about Seagull? Uh, my favorite thing about Siegel is plotting to keep Bry and Deb's talks at the same uh, <laughs> time slot, obviously. No, my favorite thing about Siegel is uh, probably working with Nathan on program. Awesome. And speaking of, next up is Nathan. So Nathan, uh, you know, Rachel said something really nice about you when we asked what her favorite thing about Siegel was. So this is your opportunity to completely just toss that right in her face. <laughs> Oh, my favorite thing about Seagull, hmm. can't say Rachel, um, <laughs> nah, Rachel's <laughs> awesome, um, but seeing everyone from all different parts of the community coming together to volunteer their time to make this conference happen, it's really a great feeling. It is all about the people. Awesome. And Sam, uh, Sam, we, we, we know that you uh, have some amazing DJ equipment that is for a totally different stream, but uh what is your favorite thing about Seagull, uh, past, present, and future? Um, I have not attended in a few years, but I'm very much uh, looking forward to using my time machine so I can participate <laughs> tomorrow. <laughs> and I believe uh, our last contestant is another returning player, and that would be Trip. Trip, can you tell us what your favorite thing about Seagull is? Uh, as someone who helped with a online conference earlier, I, I'm kind of digging the platform, but also my heart always lives with lightning talks and anything that's stressful. I love it. I love it. I love me a good, uh, ignite any, any constraints breed, uh, creativity, right? Okay. So players, if you'll notice, I did switch our, uh, Screen share over so you can go ahead and go to jackbox.tv on your mobile device, type in that code, don't read it out loud right now. And um, players, what we're gonna, we're gonna kick this off in just one second with our first game of Quiplash. The way Quiplash works is all the players are gonna get different prompts on their devices uh, that are gonna be again, associated some way towards, um, towards DevOps Cloud, something like that. And we're basically just gonna see who's, uh, who, who can make the audience the happiest. And again, uh, the more of you that are in the audience and voting, the more you can kind of sway how things go. Um, CZ, uh, what are you? Uh, what are your predictions? You know, we we've talked to people before the show. Like, you want to you want to lay out any any early? Uh, yeah, early I think thoughts. I think we obviously have some clear favorites in our returning uh, folks. So, uh, Trip and Rachel, I think, are both returning. So I think they get a uh, probably a little bit of a head start. But this game's pretty unpredictable, especially when it comes to the audience like throwing the scores and uh, giving it to someone else. So uh, it is important to vote because it's unlike uh, in the Electoral College, it does actually count. <laughs> we do keep it topical. So uh, again, Ooh. the way you can join the audience and vote is if you're uh, looking at this inside Twitch, you might see I believe it's actually sitting right above my head right now, a little wrapped up package. You click on that thing, uh, that'll oh let gosh. you join the audience. But if you feel like uh, going old school with it, uh, if you go to jackbox. I can never, I always say jackbox. jackbox.tv <laughs> and put in the code GSAU uh, will also allow you to uh, join the audience. Yes, uh, Trip and Katie are the returning members, um, Paul. For those who don't know, uh, Tai Vai is actually Australian for television. That's why he's getting it wrong. <laughs> so uh, uh, players, also I will remind you, you see this timer is going, um, you do get two prompts. So don't take this whole time on the first one because you're going to be in for a bit of a surprise uh, 
when you go when you go oh uh crap i have yet another one to do um we got 60 people in the audience this is good this is what's gonna like i know there's more people watching we can get a couple more in but this is when you got this many audience members uh it's not uncommon that all the players vote one way and the audience is just like sorry screw you it goes somewhere else so we're gonna keep this exciting uh <laughs> that's fair katie yes you may uh, may have thought you you blended in with the uh pacific northwesterners there do i need to drop back into the ochre a bit more just so you don't <laughs> confuse me and um cz so yeah <laughs> okay here we go we've got our first uh first set and uh oh there we go. We're going to move it in. Um, oh, and I already first. missed the timer. Oh, well. <laughs> so why is this the year of Linux on the desktop? Because it's not just the nerds that are alone at home this time. <laughs> <laughs> oh, one of the things I've started doing as I load these, uh, usually I only load just enough prompts that we need for the number of players, but I've started... Uh, oversubscribing it a little bit so that's a little more entertaining <laughs> for me so i don't know what's gonna come or not <laughs> and we also all know and understand it's actually the year of the gnu linux on the desktop <laughs> actually <laughs> it's what we are and what up uh, the audience pulled it over for sam sam coming out of the all gates right. okay oh this is early on for this one but what is the strategy for winning devops party games um wow. oh, this is a tough one this is a tough one uh, yeah those are both great they're in jokes they're both about oh, Corey. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> uh bear in mind as well uh players now this doesn't help you now but you're going to start to see this because uh the audience votes matter so much oh well let's see what the oh. audience oh the audience went there too oh. Nice, Nathan. <laughs> Thanks, Brian. Uh, <laughs> does have did what I could. Levels. That would have worked for any other opposition. Yeah. Visual, but, so, yeah. I, I lost my root privileges because we implemented Agile. <laughs> or, you know, <laughs> bats ate my laptop. Um, you know. These bats... are going to make me laugh so much forever. <laughs> I just, I might need to mute, but I don't want to. A DDoS production database. Wow, Katie. <laughs> oh, but the audience, ah, but not enough. The audience <gasps> favorite, oh. but it still goes to Katie. Uh, Oof. If anyone's thinking about submitting yeah, talks for Siegel next year, these are yeah. great talks. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, Topical no. is also a way to go. <laughs> one of these one of these is topical and the other just hurts because it's too real I, I don't know if i should mention that my company's current attempt at doing containerization is to boot one vm one container per vm oh they're in azure <laughs> <laughs> you know, some of us read that as VMS. <laughs> uh, oh. oh, oh, oh! So, uh, oh, so Katie no. got a freebie there. Oh. <laughs> Sam, I know it's a freebie. Wow. Oh. Well, we all know uh, the real answer is, there is Vegemite. As, as Tierney has pointed out in Jackbox, <laughs> the first round almost never counts, so nobody is expecting. <laughs> 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 I feel like I should take offense at one of these. <laughs> I guess, should you vote for the one that Fish offends you or the there? one that doesn't? This is, you know, it's not often that I sit and wish that Robin Bergeron was in the audience of a DevOps party game, but right now I really do. I really do. <laughs> but or one still supported, right? Yeah. Yeah, something like totally. that. Very secure. Okay, and I think uh, the only reason to use the blockchain is you need to do literally oh anything or a space oh, heater. <laughs> this is like two different uh, <laughs> devices here. <laughs> wow. Oh, well, I'm very interested to see if we're a team anything or team space heater here. Yeah. <laughs> By the way, we'll be selling NFTs of the best answers. To yeah! <laughs> <laughs> oh, you already have so many stickers. T-shirts. Yeah. <laughs> oh, and it goes with. Uh, I, I I thought that. Uh, by screenshots. I thought the best space heater was to uh, compile no All right, people. <laughs> why can you not hug every cat? <laughs> Some of them are standard. <laughs> 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 Oh, 
<laughs> oh no, that's so much funnier than mine. God. Oh, wow, that is that is uh, oh, that is well done. Yes, that is so well done. Guy at, an oh, Ben, a part who is angry oh. at his shell command not working. Like he wrote up this whole pipeline. And then he's like, why isn't doing anything? Because you forgot to put input onto it. <laughs> <laughs> you should pipe something through it. All right. Let's see where we are at the end of round one. Don't worry if you're not up at the top because the points are all doubling in the next round. So this was just practice, I guess. But Ben, you can still feel good about yourself. <laughs> Woo! For the moment. I, I led for a little bit. I yeah. Take that. Well, you can keep it up. You can keep it up. All right. This is uh, now bringing us into round two. It's more of the same, but twice as much. Points wise, game wise, it's exactly the same amount. Uh, I I really feel like that that cat joke uh, with standard input. I was like, that's 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 quite good. That was a sleeper. That's <laughs> a few edits. That was yeah. really slick. <laughs> I always have to. It's sort of like when you do the podcast and you have to figure out. You're like, okay, that's what I'm going to pull for the cold cold open. So like on our website. I take a screenshot of like my favorite quiplash and I know we're only halfway through. Y'all can do better. Maybe there'll be more, but that's a front runner already. You know, I, I just I want to point out in advance. Thank you. That someone was that witty in that short amount of time. Yet Sam couldn't answer a question about snacks. <laughs> <laughs> that was uncalled for. <laughs> Um, uh, so while we're doing this, a couple things, especially if this is your first time uh, with DevOps Party Games, you may not have heard this. I put a link in the chat already. Uh, if you want to go find uh, older games, uh, our website's DevOpsPartyGames.com. And, uh, but also, uh, if you or someone you know, or you want to recommend somebody to uh, be on a future episode of the show, I just dropped a link in the chat for we've got a fancy little Airtable form that'll, that'll hook you right up and you can shove that in there and I will happily ignore it. Um, I'm just kidding. That's uh, quite a few people have been on the show that way. And Five seconds, as... y'all. Yep. Okay. Oh, oh, oh. Quick, quick. I just got in there and it was not funny. Oh, okay. Well, we're <laughs> the audience will be the judge of that. <laughs> <laughs> You're like, so like, yes, yes, they will. <laughs> yeah. All right. What is the best reason to get fired? <laughs> Yeah. That's wow. that's a little too real, but yeah, go for it. Uh, is that is that ice, as in like what Australians call ice? No, or is that ice no, as in just um, ice? The immigration and customer. Yeah, yeah. Ah. like drop ice you know, as get, a customer. Yeah, so, yeah. GitHub's so, so, GitHub favorite customer. Gotcha. Right. <laughs> so not the good drugs, then. Damn it. <laughs> Maybe oh, I have wait, some what? though. Sorry, I couldn't think of anything funny. I'm just like, <laughs> I, this is all I could think of. Oh, ethics. oh, but the audience, the audience. Uh... <laughs> Woo! <laughs> hey, thanks, Rachel. <laughs> okay, what does YAML really stand for? <laughs> Let me loudly hear you. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Let's just move to JSON. <laughs> yeah. No, no, didn't you see just JSON's canceled? JSON's canceled. Just stream right. on. <laughs> Back to XML then? Yeah. Oh, yeah, sure. That's how it's, yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, I think Nathan, <laughs> Nathan's going to run away with that one. Yeah. Well, we didn't <laughs> expose. We didn't need to structure our data anyway. Yeah. <laughs> What's something you'd find in my Twitter drafts? Hot takes on like huh. Kubernetes or no drafts, just YOLO. Yep. That's. Favorite. I always like going back and finding stuff. You're like, why is this even a draft? I actually tweeted that, you know. So these are your Twitter drafts, right, man? Yeah, they could be. <laughs> mine, mine, mine's full of uh, YubiKey output. <laughs> <laughs> those aren't drafts for me. Those are those are published. <laughs> I, I have actually actually accidentally put triggered the YubiKey with Twitter focused and keyboard shortcuts on. I have no idea what happened. <laughs> Ben, you are having this, uh, <laughs> that is my worst LinkedIn. <laughs> so <laughs> excited. <laughs> oh, there's, there's a YubiKey app right there. <laughs> Sops. <laughs> Oh my god. I had to read that three times to figure out what QOX was. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, yeah, I did the same thing. It's it's odd. 
<laughs> Can I have the oxport? <laughs> That was. Oh, you nailed it! Trip ran away with that one. Oh, well played, Trip. I could have put the infinity symbol in there. Yeah. Maybe you could. More titles. Episode is making me so happy. <laughs> I can't stop I laughing at these. <laughs> oh, where does the audience go? Yep, audience goes with Sam. That Ran away was, with some that points. That was an there. eight second answer. I oh. that was not funny. <laughs> was that the one you said wasn't funny? Oh, oh. yeah. Oh. <laughs> oh. oh. Yeah, like, this hurts. This yeah. hurts. <laughs> <laughs> the answer is DVC. Yeah, yeah. I'm gonna stress eat cheese puffs now. <laughs> <laughs> Good call. That one's funny. That's my favorite the thing. There's many things Trip does that I think are awesome, but eating cheese puffs with chopsticks is my favorite thing ever, because oh, it yeah. makes so much sense to me. <laughs> because I don't like yes. things on my yes. ears. You're right. I hit the wrong button. <laughs> All right. <laughs> I'm sorry, bro. <Brian. laughs> I googled <laughs> Kubernetes and I got. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. A very this sad is... promotion. <laughs> this is the image for uh, for the episode. That's the screenshot. That's the one. This is it. Yeah. <laughs> and the teeth is. <laughs> oh, where, where's he in cold water? <laughs> That's a, potentially the other answer you could get for this question. Right, yeah. <laughs> Ian Coldwater, yeah. Yes. <laughs> a bunch of goose oh. things. Ooh. Oh. Well, Victor, oh. Victor, you can vote twice if you open up an incognito window, probably. <laughs> can confirm. Title of my next conference talk. <laughs> Kates and Cats for Sweet Baby Rays. I like Kates and Cats. Yeah. And that actually might have to be a talk. KubeCon yeah, CFP is open. Quite oh. cute. I you know, I, I, if someone I says do, need some barbecue. I do title driven <laughs> talk development anyway, so. <laughs> Schrodinger's cat was actually the first cat to go in a container. <laughs> oh, nice. oh. I'm sorry, wow. I do have to go if you yeah. don't. Yeah. 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 <laughs> Just make a pee off. You got me, Deb. Uh, yeah, that was good, oh. Deb. That's... <laughs> Oh, we got a right, bunch yeah. of quiplashes. I Kates love and, it. Wow. Kates and cats <laughs> should be a talk at KatieCon, as Hashman says. That's perfect. Oh. <laughs> what do you think about KatieCon? All right. So, as we see where we sit after round two. Oh, Ben. <laughs> Rachel just. I swapped wow. oh. bottom to top. <laughs> All right. <laughs> so, Thriplash is just a little different. And uh, what's going to happen is you're all going to get one prompt. You're only get one prompt this time, but it's a prompt that will have, you're going to give three answers and you can do maybe a serial of three. Maybe it's kind of a build. You run your comedy the way that makes you feel good. Um, and you're going to get the same prompt as one other person. And that's uh, that's pretty much how Thriplash goes. Uh, it is as is DevOps party games tradition while you're all doing this and Paul and I have to vamp. This is the part when I tell you that in the older version of Quiplash that we used to play, you didn't put custom content in the last round, so that came from the game. And almost every time, it was something that absolutely 100% violated the code of conduct, which is what got us the uh, open source project and web website, logsquirt.io. So. No. <laughs> Katie, I can't believe you don't know about KatieCon. It seems it was literally made for you. It's a conference of all, all the speakers are Katie's. Huh. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Hmm. Oh. oh. This is a really long time. It's Thriplash, man. It's there's uh, three Excuse things. me, it's uh Triplash, thank you very much. Oh yes. Fifteen seconds. Timer's going. 
This brings us into the tail end of uh, Quiplash. Okay. I completely bombed that, so... Okay, yeah, that going timer easy. got me. Three reasons not to play on Friday. <laughs> In which time zone? <laughs> <laughs> or you're left to make it the cafe. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I, oh. I love me a good callback. <laughs> <laughs> there's, there's there's a double call back there. Mm -hmm. yeah, also there's renamed two. the company Meta. Yeah, that's what, that I was gonna say. You had the the two, so. I'm just gonna uh, assume that you don't have enough whiskey was an answer for one of the ones that didn't make it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Did someone just use their three answers from the previous rounds because they're lazy? Because that worked. Because that's, that's, <laughs> that's a legit strategy. I, I may have. Yes. Yep. Exactly. And it, it, it and you won. And it works. Nathan, I like that we were on the same page. <laughs> yep, co-chairs for life. Okay. Uh, <laughs> three, <laughs> three, three, three. <laughs> Wait, okay, did, did we know we had this prompt about deploying on Fridays? <laughs> no, so see it kind of, this is, oh, wow, I, I, I oh, we're, really. We're gonna I, get, we're gonna get yelled at it on Twitter again over this. Oh like, yeah. I, I don't, don't know really hope Corey what to watching. do. Well, I'm not I'm worried about it. Corey's fine. It's deploying the third rail of Friday deploys. Is what is the problem. <laughs> so, let's just check charity on this and we'll be good to go. I was going to say, talking shit about Corey's safe as hell. <laughs> he actually volunteered oh, to join us today because he thought it was going to be in person. Oh, uh, and he's oh, like, oh, I'm going to be in Seattle, PG? but I can't do it if it's, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> uh, three celebrities. <laughs> Jeez, I wonder. <laughs> <laughs> I I really want to oh. hear what Miss Piggy has to say. I, there is so. a I would love Miss Piggy as like a project manager, scrum master on an SRV oh, no. team. Like she would just fucking rule. Oh, oh there it is. There it is. <laughs> I mean, you did make it really Miss Piggy that, over that Mr. Was, Rogers. That was a good one. <laughs> oh, the audience will decide, and they go with Ben and Miss Piggy. Woo! <laughs> All right, and uh, three reasons oh, dogs no. make excellent test engineers. Oh, oh, situations. Okay, oh, I'm sorry. Oh, that. You know, yeah, yeah. Who did that? whoever did the second one, you tried, but this just—I I feel like the first set just ran away with it. They really uh, did. <laughs> I don't know. I feel like it's chasing its tail. <laughs> oh. I hate puns, so I was never going to yeah. win this one. <laughs> yeah. Excuse me? Oh, it's true. <laughs> My answer would have been really don't type on your keyboard in prod. <laughs> there is, and let's see, Ben, did, uh, let's see if Ben pulled himself up. Rachel, I feel he like, is going to be the winner because... She was already up there. She it's ran really away close. with that. Oh, but oh, it's God! What an upset! Oh. It really was a nice trip lash. It was Woo. a trip lash. It was indeed a trip lash. <laughs> uh, so I was like, let's see a couple of the top Recap. answer of the game was needing virtual VC. <laughs> trip was trip was our winner. Um, we're gonna go ahead and. Um, see if maddie is properly ready yep okay uh contestants you can go ahead and get yourself loaded up for uh drawful here uh <laughs> trip can you grab oh oh i have it because i did it on my phone katie also okay. got it oh perfect okay we've got it like lots of places and those of you in the I, audience you don't even know what we're talking about but that's okay it's an inside joke it's not really i, I Redundancy. just started um I, I just started typing on the wrong keyboard to enter the room code so it worked really well Perfect. Okay, so uh, what I was going to say is these are loading up, um, and we're getting we're getting ready to go. And I think I can actually switch. Everybody is on there. Okay, cool. Um, oh, wait, wait, we're, we're still we're still waiting. I don't. Have you're to still drawing. I, I just meant I could show okay. the screen. To, I could show oh, okay. the screen to the audience because they can't accidentally decide to be part of the show. Actually, you're all part of the show. We love you all. Um, there is a uh, one of my favorite moments on DevOps Party Games occurred in one of the times when Corey was on, and it's I, I I'm gonna have to clean up the language a little bit, but uh, he made a very Corey joke, and you just hear this audio of Tim Banks going, "Get out, Corey Quinn, get the out." 
And I have I have a bitly to that exact moment. It makes me so happy. Um, and it was it was perfect. Okay, so what's gonna happen in this game of drawful now? Uh, the players are all gonna get one prompt on their device of something to draw. Um, and then everyone has to kind of guess what that what that might be. What are the real answers? Players, remember, there is no erase in Drawful, but you do get two colors. Yeah, you just don't get to pick what they are. Oh, we have some amazing pictures here. Look at this. Trip, Deb, Rachel, they're all like, look exactly like they do. Ben, wow, all of you. Exactly. <laughs> uh, it's like I mean, Ben looks like a photograph, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. He looks even more like that in person. Sam, are you mm -hmm. catching or throwing a laptop? I, I drew the lines on yes. the wrong side and realized there was no erase. Um, so the, so the, 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 someone's, it be, it's someone's <laughs> throwing the laptop at Sam. <laughs> it's, uh, it's a depiction of me getting uh, prod pages escalated to me. Let me update to the... Oh, uh, yeah, and yes, yoink, yoink versus yeet. Uh, a, a yeet is in fact a reverse yoink. What? Checks out. Okay, it's um, a lot of facts. I've updated the. Uh, <laughs> Wait, is that an avatar or a Tinder profile? Okay, everybody's in. We oh, can no. get started. <laughs> is that JSON or YAML? <laughs> I think it's handwriting. <laughs> Comic Sans. <laughs> A nice way to Everyone's talk about favorite font. Duh. <laughs> Again with the apologies in advance. Oh no. <laughs> <clears throat> oh no. So you do have a fair amount of time to draw. So take a second, give it some thought. Uh, but you don't have forever and ever. And it looks like you're sitting there, you're like, it's totally a lot of time. And then the pencil's like, bah, 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 bah. so. You know, that's the thing that happens. There are no apologies in Drawful. The Drawful is full of apologies, Waldo. If you're still watching, um, I don't have the right colors to draw the picture I want. Yeah, so that's actually an interesting point. So um, sometimes it will happen where you'll see the drawing and your guess will be connected to something that has to do with the color. Remember, nobody gets to pick the colors, so it's probably not related to that. Um, now, I will also, uh, this is probably a thing we should have reminded uh, at the beginning. Um, some of you are gonna be mad, especially uh, Trip, who won the first round. Uh, this is an unranked game, which means that oh. points uh, scored in this uh, game do not count toward your position on the thought leaderboard. Um, so uh, if that means you just Who wanna kinda, point? yeah, exactly. Um, oh, that but we will. Crazy. We will figure out who is the winner. Now that said, the way we score the thought leaderboard, there's double, there's two point opportunities in Drawful, which is being most, uh, most uh, getting the most, earning the most points, but also earning the most likes. So pandering and going for humor and not, uh, not gameplay can work uh, in your advantage, uh, if that's a thing that uh, matters to you. And the thought leaderboard is more of a popularity contest anyway. It's not a real thing. <laughs> Uh, it exists. <laughs> the thought leaderboard exists because Paul made a joke about there being something called a thought leaderboard, and literally, I had a Trello card that said "Do something with Paul's joke about thought leaderboard," <laughs> and we made Laura write a uh, actual scoreboard. Okay, what is it? So now, uh, players, what you're going to put on your device here is a feasible because you're going to want to put in an answer that other people will think is the right answer, so they guess it instead of the real one. Right, like I said, sort of like Balderdash or there's other games like that. Uh, it'll make a whole lot of sense after this first one if you haven't done it before. I like how like Trip is pointing at the drawing. Yeah, that's good. Now we're not letting <laughs> guess right Finger now because they're guessing, right? You should not guess. Yes, right. yeah. Now, actually, no. To be fair, Paul, you can because you don't know what the answers were. Right. When this has been a problem before is when one of the hosts who knows the answer goes, oh, it's waterfall programming. And you're like, oh. you know, um, no, you you actually saw it. So all right, well, I'm going to call it I'm going to call it death by YAML. I will go so far like as YAML, a YAML value. <laughs> to be fair, I don't points. I have no idea even what it is. And I wrote this these prompts. So, um, <laughs> <laughs> so that's. 
Okay. <gasps> Whoa. Did I get it? Do I get points? <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. The, the worst part about because I know the answers is I can't comment on the ones that I think are funny because that makes it clear that that wasn't the answer, right? Like, if you know, if I'm like, oh, my God, that's so funny. So I have to wait till I'll, I'll tell you the ones I think are funny when they when they come in. Um, audience, <laughs> you will get your chance to uh, you should should have an opportunity to to pick. <laughs> You basically what you do is audience uh yeah you say okay you have to guess what the real what you think the real title is and you'll get a chance to uh also throw in a bonus like oh. and here are your picks. <laughs> okay so is it my second <laughs> auth factor no but you got a couple people with that one your skeletal structure can be a second factor <laughs> oh. i personally think that my skin is my personal fire <gasps> Skin for production. <laughs> it looks sort of gross anyway. I don't know what yeah. there. I but the real the answer colors. is, Paul, I can't believe it. <laughs> it's like he's in your head. Who I mean, drew it to a bigger nail. audience. And whose drawing was that? That was uh, uh, Sam, That was right? me. Yeah. <laughs> I take back oh, everything I, I said about it. Bri, that was Bri, yeah. <laughs> What do I get wow. after? I'm in a title now. Uh. <laughs> this one. I, again, have written these prompts and could not tell you. <laughs> I mean, it's clearly a warm glass of shut up. <laughs> <laughs> Is that a pumpkin spice latte? <laughs> Oh, it is still PSL season, isn't it? <laughs> I want to put a second answer in. Does anybody uh, mind? No, I can't do that. <laughs> well, you could oh. say it out loud. Is that um, what you were getting at? Yeah, something like that. <laughs> 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 we don't need garbage we don't need garbage clips and wow who's a c programmer in here yeah. <laughs> can i get an raia in the chat <laughs> No USC one here either. <laughs> <laughs> That's surprising that that didn't use, you know, maybe we've grown as a society. Yeah. We're well, regional. I, that can't be it. <laughs> that couldn't be it. <laughs> Sorry. I do like that it's a recyclable trash fire rather than just a regular old trash fire. We weren't oh, able yeah. to deliver it last quarter, so we're definitely going to do it this quarter. <laughs> Agile. Oh, yeah. oh, I think you all got it. Yeah, that's a big pull there. Good job, Sam. <laughs> all right. Some big points there. Don't forget to award those uh, bonus likes, because really this is a popularity contest, as, as CZ pointed out. <laughs> all right, what is it here? That's a good drawing, but I don't know what it's supposed to be. I yeah, mean, well, I know what it's supposed to be, but I, I don't know what it's no supposed idea. to be. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. Did, 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 did Paul do this? Oh, no. I'm glad somebody Tell me it. it's not the lamp stuck running on containers. <laughs> oh. Oh, no. Oh. <laughs> I like how multiple of us have laptops in our little <laughs> in your self avatars. Yeah. <laughs> your duty lamp just... <laughs> One of my favorite things to do is go back through the answers that weren't the real Guiding ones. Light. 
and turn them into. Uh, yeah. <laughs> I think <laughs> some like of these are gonna <laughs> are gonna come back as uh, as uh, uh, real prompts. I'm gonna tell you. I, I like how those answers work on top of each other. Guiding light of how they do it at Kubernetes and at Google. And you're not my light. <laughs> Someone turn the headset off already. Thanks, Dave. <laughs> <laughs> it is though the lamp stack yeah, Mark which it tells you when you guess lamp I, stack that you can't I do I, I, I wish I wish it was lamp stack running on containers though because that <laughs> yeah that is going to be a new prompt isn't it I yeah. can yeah. see it a mile away that's amazing <laughs> We also I wish I was more playing. callbacks. Yeah. <laughs> we have more callbacks than a JavaScript application doing this in this game. Oh, <laughs> you see, nobody saw that because I wasn't talking. So. Oh uh, my God. Uh, what? <laughs> oh, this one is. We we got in there really fast. <laughs> yeah, I feel. I, I feel like this oh is one God. of those that if you type in the real answer, it'll tell you. And I gotta believe that at least one of you typed in the real answer on this one. I mean, I typed it in and, in and I'm like, it's either gonna bounce back at me or yeah. someone else will have spelled it wrong or something. I mean, this is. <laughs> I, I believe this one's the uh, sexy Google Halloween costume. <laughs> <laughs> All right. oh. <laughs> okay. Oh my god. <laughs> everybody, everybody, but one. <laughs> I, I want to know who's who's out in the cold here. The one who works at Google. <laughs> uh, Do we have a Googler with us today? Hi, Sam. I worked on two yeah. of those. Oh. <laughs> I think I missed oh. that <laughs> Gotcha. <laughs> it's... I mean, it's everybody's right. Guess. Like, there's going to be a point <laughs> distribution here, but, like, yeah. everybody is correct. <laughs> it's clearly products that Google's bring back from the grave. <laughs> hey, Google. you know what? I'll take Zombie Reader. Oh, I can get Zombie Reader. Oh, my God, totally right? <laughs> So my no, no. favorite drawful DevOps party games ever is the uh, the drawing was of the Republican National uh, Headquarters and the prompt no. was significant white space. <gasps> <laughs> that I believe that might have been you, Paul. I I, I actually kind of wonder if it was. I, I feel like it does um, sound like something I might say. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> Bye. <laughs> I need another drink for this. <laughs> Wait, is that the prompt? I think that's the prompt. <laughs> the shooting Elon Musk into the sun. <laughs> Grimes. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god! <laughs> What's funny is, is there's two of these are actual prompts I wrote. I don't know which one it is. <laughs> <laughs> and and they work actually perfectly for either of them are great. <laughs> I think I know which one it is, but <laughs> it's not Grimes. Sorry. <laughs> I'm so it should have been though. Yeah. <laughs> Putting your bikes away. <laughs> that's a that's a when you're calling back to the the pre-show. <laughs> that's a that's a deep cut. <laughs> it's a good feeling though. Mm -hmm. Putting your bikes away, yeah. It is. It really is. I think putting your bikes away is a new uh, slang term for. Uh, going off call for uninstalling page duty. <laughs> I gotta go put my bike away. In the bike shed? Oh In my the gosh. bike shed. <laughs> I did it a little abstractly, so, <laughs> you know, <laughs> but, uh-oh, no one got it? Oh. Uh, <laughs> it's a hard one, I'm gonna give uh, you that. It's a that, little abstract, I think yeah. I went a little too far, but <laughs> I thought it was funny. <laughs> 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 
I would have accepted just the words, bless your heart. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I forgot I was muted. <laughs> it's uh, cl Cloud Economist Corey Quinn. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> also, this is the prompt that makes everybody mad. <laughs> As opposed to every other prompt. <laughs> this is one of the people. <laughs> I just feel like I remember the last time we had it, people were like, what? Where did you get that? I'm like, hey, this is, it's not easy to come up with 16 of these a month. <laughs> Katie, give us a fun platypus fact. Ah, did you know that platypuses are one of only two animals that uh, secrete milk and lay their own eggs? So they're one of two animals that can create their own custard. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, just, just so you're aware, I'm the other animal. <laughs> the other one is Paul. <laughs> <laughs> These are all pretty good. <laughs> I love that. Oh my god, Maddie, you need to you need to get better at your job, Maddie, because no one made a Halloumi reference. I know it's not good. <laughs> Is this Halloumi a Halloumi? Halloumi? What's that? <laughs> the squeakiest cheese. Yeah. <laughs> That's not angry enough to be Billy. That's the thing, right? Billy's always really mad. <laughs> Resting Billy face. <laughs> I'm glad I got one with that. <laughs> and the real answer is, it's, of course, it's a platypus writing JavaScript, because why not? <laughs> oh, so it really is Palooza. Okay. Which is not Where's even what I meant when I wrote that. That was just sometimes I write these and I just take words and put them together because <laughs> they're funny to me. <laughs> and I was probably thinking about work a little bit when I was thinking about a platypode, about platypodes. But you know, um, wow. I don't. I don't know what I'm looking at. Um, <laughs> oh, sometimes no. if you turn your head, it doesn't help. <laughs> <laughs> I, that is yeah, this it, case. It, it, yeah. Confirmed. I tried it. Um, turn, turn their head is uh, increase the timeouts and reset the service for this. Is it supposed to be a bomb? Is that a really badly drawn bomb next to a really badly drawn laptop? B -O -C -O -B -O -N -G. Oh, you say bomb? Yeah. Is, is it a grenade? <laughs> right? Are we going to play something don't, up? I don't know. Um, <laughs> don't worry. You'll all hate me when you see what it is. Oh, uh, we already hate you. Oh, good. I... Yeah, we have a start. <laughs> Ten seconds. So my, my question on the, the platypus with JavaScript is, where are the semicolons? <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. Oh, oh no. Wow. <laughs> I... It's a pair? Oh. <laughs> oh, oh, I... <laughs> Oh, Wait, it's uh, a yeah, pair? I, I in fact jeez. Oh, oh, wow. <laughs> Pairs can't Pairs program, they haven't got hands. <laughs> oh, oh. oh it's too slow. I wanted to grab that one. <laughs> I thought it was a straw, not a stem. <laughs> yeah, I also read straw. <laughs> I, I'm all up for two gallons of uh, sangria, though. So. <laughs> <laughs> we'll get you where you gotta oh, go. I like apple cor me. apple core dump is pretty pretty good though. <laughs> that may <laughs> show up in a future game. <laughs> True. <laughs> how, much is, how much is two gallons? It's enough that you don't need a recipe from the internet. Eight liters. <laughs> it's just and it is pair programming. In your oh. house into uh, the biggest container. container you have yeah or the yeah. sink yeah <laughs> about eight liters in case it was a real life <laughs> question yeah. i am so frustrated the it was a real question on <laughs> it only took me 12 years of living here to <sighs> work out the uh tr translation there oh what the heck <laughs> seriously <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> this is con control. Control lemon X. Lemon X. There's your lemon party <laughs> joke, Paul. <laughs> no, no. Oh. I PG thirteen. <laughs> Maddie, Maddie, Maddie. It is. You a... tell me I can't make the joke and then you steal it from me. <laughs> <laughs> well, wait, Sorry, what was God. that joke you stole from me on Twitter like six months ago? I don't remember what it was we, now. We stole it from each other. I know, but I can't remember what it was now. I can't remember. It must have been hilarious. <laughs> it was definitely hilarious. <laughs> Someone has um, to keep adding for scotch. <laughs> <laughs> that also might have to be a future prompt. <laughs> <laughs> uh, <laughs> oh, we all have the theme here. <laughs> what? What? What is the idea of me first? I don't know. I, do I want to know? I kind of want it to be uh, regular expressions. I like that. I mean, I feel like the the meat verse is going to be IBM Cloud's new uh, like metaverse offering, jumping on the bandwagon oh, with fucking oh, Nike no. and Micro. Oh, oh, um, oh, well, and excuse me. Well, it's okay. We're off the air now, so you can say whatever you want. We just got pulled. We're not. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I guess IBM has a cloud made of meat. So it makes sense that their uh, metaverse would be made out of meat too. No, the meat meat is an anagram for meta. Yeah, I feel like what tough, tough what? And and what's an anagram? <laughs> Billy Graham's wife. Meat. Uh, yay. These are really. Oh wow! We didn't even oh. see it. the game was over. Oh, okay, damn. wow. But let's see who was the most popular because that's really what this is all about. And the answer there is Rachel. What? Get a little crown. I feel like oh, I didn't win anything. Close. Yay, great. I'll take it. Woo. So fantastic. Uh, great. Well, this has been a whole lot of fun. Uh, sea, sea gullers, sea galleons. What do you, what do you call people that do seagull things? Thanks, sea seagulls. I like, like sea flock, oh, just seagulls. Like just, a flock of seagulls. Yeah. I think I'm going to call y'all sea galleons now, though, because I feel like it rhymes with Hegelian for some reason. Yeah. I don't know. It's so. not good. <laughs> Probably I not. We'll I, just... was, I thought anyway. I was going to say gall. Say gall's? <laughs> oh, Steven Seagal. Is that like who vegetable? Who vegetable? What? Yeah. Um, so that's going to bring us uh, to the end of our show. So uh, everybody, thank you for playing. Um, there's a whole nother day of Seagull tomorrow. So if you uh, are tuning into this stream now and you are not already registered and ready to join, um, Rachel, you want to tell everybody like how they can fix that? Yeah, like, absolutely. You so if you, if you just get over to attend.seagull, that's S-E-A-G-L dot org, attend.seagull.org, uh, you can enter with just your name uh, and see all the talks. And they start at, at uh, nine, oh, 9 or 9.30, Nathan? 9.15. 9.15. It's Thank you, It's the costume Doug. contest, and then 9.30 is our talks from the Eleanor Webbers, I think. Um, and uh, in about 20 minutes, we're going to do cocktails and mocktails with Miko uh, back in the oh. um, stream yard. So you don't even have to wait till tomorrow for more yeah. seagull fun. Okay, you so can just like go jet over there now. Yeah. Awesome. Thanks, everybody. Uh, we'll uh, see you on the internet. And again, if you enjoyed this and you'd like to know when we have future ones, I just dropped a link in the chat to our mailing list, which I can assure you we will not spam you because I usually forget that it even exists. So <laughs> sign up for a mailing list where you may or may not get an email every couple months from me. Uh, other than that, uh, thank all of our players. Paul, thank you for being uh, an absolutely luscious host, co-host with me. And go watch your pleasure. hair. And Thanks a lot, we'll Maddie and Paul. Yep. We will see you all on the internet. Thank you. Thanks for Thank you. Bye. Bye. Bye.